It's a scam that's become so normalized that we don't even realize it's a scam anymore. Wealth, especially in the sense of business and taxes. So there are a couple different ways that business and wealth are scams, especially in the sense of taxes. But first, we're going to start with LLCs and business trusts. So let me explain everything before you try to figure out what it means. So all the way up here at the top, you have the LLC. The LLC is basically a government recognized corporation. You signed up and LLC stands for Limited Liability Corporation. Over here where that M was, that stands for me. And as the branch off of the LLC and the 5% down here, what that represents is I am a 5% owner of my LLC. Now, who owns the 95%? This circle right here, the BT stands for business trust. It owns 95% of the profits. Now, with a trust, you have a trustee, a creator, and a beneficiary. The creator gives their power to somebody else. The trustee is the one who kind of has the ability to make the decisions and the beneficiaries get no rights to make the decisions, but they get the benefits. So the T right here, this T stands for the trustee. The trustee would be me in this situation. But what are you going to do with this 95% of money? Because you're going to have to pay taxes on it, right? Well, if you have this business trust, you can make a family trust. That's what this stands for right here. You can make that the beneficiary of your business trust. Now, trusts have this cool ability to be able to donate their entire profits to their beneficiary. So going back up here to that 95%, you donate it to your family trust. And since it was a donation, it's not taxable. So now in your family trust, you have a trustee again and you have the beneficiary. Just like it's a same theme, the trustee would be me and the beneficiaries would be like my kids, for example. That's what the guy used in his video explaining this as well. So with that 95% of the profits that you're putting into your family trust, you're able to use it to buy things for your beneficiary and the trustee is the person who gets to use that money. This is literally what Donald Trump taught Waka Flocka on how to get out of taxes. Another thing with taxes and scams, if I work from home, which I personally do, the room that I use as my business room, the percentage of the rent that goes towards that specific room, the utilities and all of the other bills that goes toward that specific room, all of that total can be a tax deduction. Do you want to go on vacation? Well, if you have a business that travels with you and you are the owner of that business and you go on vacation business vacation and do some work you can use that money you spent on the vacation as a tax deduction are you the face of your brand you want to get your teeth whitened you can whiten your teeth say that it is for the promotion of your business to make the face of the brand look better and that could be a tax deduction now it's not just that simple but it it's also that simple learn the loopholes y'all they keep it a secret for a reason